Hi everyone, it's Becca. I just have a really quick uh, Thanksgiving card to share with you. Um, in Canada, it is Thanksgiving Monday and I'm going for dinner tonight uh, to my mom's house to have some turkey and then uh, I'm going to my husband's sister's house on Monday. So lots of turkey. Except for, for me for Thanksgiving, I love Thanksgiving but it's hard just because I can't eat anything with wheat or dairy or eggs in it, so all that yummy stuffing and gravy and mashed potatoes, I can't have any of that, so it's just like, it's great hanging out with everybody, but at the same time it's hard when it's just like, oh, I really want to eat that. <laughs> but anyways, um, so this is my Thanksgiving card. So I used to create a Critter cartridge. Um, for this turkey and he is on page 70 and so I did this little turkey it was four cuts and uh, I did it at three and a half inches so I did the little turkey um, and I really like how he turned out and I just inked um, I was gonna say distress but I didn't distress I inked all the edges with my uh, Essentials uh, ink dauber and the Tim Holtz vintage photo. So that's what I used on the edges of everything, including all the different parts of the turkey, just to give it a little bit more dimension. And then um, right here, I stamped this sentiment, give, st give thanks. It's just a uh, Michael's stamp. I got it for $1.50. Um, and then I just didn't stamp uh, that part. So I just stamped the top and I didn't stamp the bottom uh, to get my sentiment. So that's where the sentiment's from. And then I have no idea where this little brad and flower combination came from. Something probably from Kijiji, I believe, is where I got it. So that's um, just a little flower and then a brad in the center of it. And I really liked, just gave it that little extra something. And, uh... I didn't actually add ribbon on this one, which um, I usually add ribbon for everything. I also I used some glitter glue, uh, right, just on the, just to give a little definition to his hat and his wings. And I really like how that turned out nice and bold. Um, and then these two little maple leaves here are from Wild Orchid Crafts, and I just inked around the edges and glued them on. Just to, I thought the corner needed something. And then around the edges, I used my white gel pen, and I did little dash lines. And that card is uh, four and a quarter by five and a half. So I really like how it turned out. I think it's really, really cute. And all the paper for the background. Sorry, guys. My craft table is a mess right now. I'll try to get without the glare of the sun. But it's this bow bunny pack. It's got lots of nice fall colors. Um... It's not a fall collection pack. I just liked the colors on it. So that's what this is. And I used this um, before. And so this is called the Weekend Market Collection. So that's where all the paper came from. So I just thought I would show you this really quick card before I head over to my parents. And I hope you guys are all having a wonderful day. And if you're in Canada, happy Thanksgiving. Bye.